Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So ignore this jumper that I'm wearing. This is actually my boyfriend's jumper that he wears to work. It is clean. It's come out of the wash, but it's like one of his work jumpers, so it's like stained. Um I just popped it on, you know. It says El Wager, my future last name. Um so today obviously another really exciting video i am literally a content creator at the moment i am banging out so much content this is the third video that i'm filming in one day like who am i who am i um weirdo clearly <laughs> um so today i'm going to be trying on some fashion nova maxi dresses now i was going to call this like i was going to start like a series like showing you all my maxi dresses because i own so many maxi dresses i love them especially for holiday i always opt for a maxi dress i don't know why i just feel like it looks classy it's like mum vibes um but yeah basically the maxi dress that i'm going to try on i haven't tried them on since i wore them when i was pregnant with riley so i will insert the photos of what they look like um when i was pregnant with riley when i'm trying them on but yeah, I haven't even tried them on, so I have no idea what they're going to look like. But they are, they're not maternity dresses, they're just normal dresses. So I thought it'll be cute and fun and like a trip down memory lane to wear, try on these dresses that I wore when I was pregnant. So, not sure what I'm going to call this video, either like a maxi dress haul or like trying on dresses when I was pregnant. Um, but yeah, I had, so it must have been like two years since I've worn them because Riley's nearly two. So yeah, it's like nearly two years. I think it's been like two years because I wore them when I was like six months pregnant. Anyway, enough chitter chatter and let's show you guys the dresses. Okay, so this is the first dress. Now, when you look at it, you might be thinking like, oh my God, that's so out there. And it is, it definitely is very out there, but I like to stand out. Um, and I think this is called on the website, like a work of art dress because it does look like a painting. But anyway, it's like, I assume that the stripes because they like go inwards, Ooh, love that for me, just throwing my dress over my head, because those stripes like go like this, I assume that, well obviously last time I wore it I was fat, fat AF, um, so I assume that they are going to make me now look sucked in, so let's try it on and have a look what we look like, what it looks like, and hopefully I look sexy. Okay, so before I step back and show you what it looks like, I'm just going to insert the photo now of what it did look like when I was pregnant. I feel like I need to put like, some Vaseline on my lips or something because they are so dry. Um, but yeah, I'm going to insert the photo now of what I looked like when I was pregnant in this dress. Okay, and now, step back for the big reveal. This is what it looks like. Supermodel! <laughs> um, honestly, I'm not going to lie. Obviously, I know that you have to be quite a, um, I mean, I'm not a very confident person, I'm not going to lie, but you have to be, you have to not be afraid to stand out if you're going to wear this dress, because let me just, sorry, just trying to show you what it looks like. Um, it's, why am I trying to do, why am I jumping like that? It's really, really weird, and I look like really lanky and weird. Um, but yeah, I'm just trying to show you that it's a maxi dress. Um, but maybe I could just move it down a bit. But yeah, I feel like um, this is very, I need a bra, basically, because <laughs> that could be a potential nip slip. Um, but yeah, this is what the dress looks like on. I feel like I would wear this again if I was pregnant, but I don't think that I'm going to wear it now. Um, I mean, I've got nowhere to wear it, and I've, I don't know. It does definitely look like a work of art, though. It's like body paint, doesn't it? Someone's like poured a bucket of paint over my head. Um... But yeah, I do like this dress. It's very um, fashion novery. They've got this in like a few different colours, like a beige colour. I feel like a beige. And it's got like the, the belt and you squeeze it. This one hasn't got a belt, but when you put the belt on it, you squeeze it and it makes you look like that. But anyways, this one hasn't got a belt. Um, but yeah, um, I don't think I'll be wearing this dress anytime soon. I haven't got anywhere to wear it anyways. And yeah, maybe if I get pregnant again, then I'll wear it. Um, because I definitely did like it when I was fat. <laughs> but like when you're pregnant, a maxi dress is like really fluttering on the bum because I don't know. I just feel like a maxi dress is a good look with a with a baby bump. So yeah, definitely recommend getting this dress. Anyways, it's really nice, really stretchy, really. Um, obviously it's stretched enough to get over my bum, and it's stretching. It's like it's 
yeah I like this dress and I'm going to show you the next one now. Right, so I'm going to speed it up a bit because my baby is asleep right downstairs and I don't want to wake him up or um, I want to get this film before he wakes up. So this is the next dress that I wore when I was pregnant and again, I will show you what it looked like on me when I was pregnant. Do you know what? The material, I didn't realise how nice and thick it is. Like, it's so, can you see how thick that is? It's like double lined, but the material itself, it doesn't have to be double lined, like it's so thick. Um, wow, I'm definitely looking like a crazy person. Um, oh, it's so nice and soft as well. I've only worn this once. So I should probably wear it again. Um, it's like a high neck. Um, it's got like this ruche, ruche side. I wore both of these dresses in Tenerife, by the way. I go to Tenerife quite a lot. Um, it's got like this ruche side, so it's like proper classy. Um, brown. Love a brown dress. I wore this with like some big... Does it? Is it low cut or is it high cut? No, it's high cut. Oh no, it's got like this cut out bit here. If you remember, it's got like a cut out bit there. Um, oh no, it doesn't. <laughs> Sorry, it has a cut out bit there and then it comes back around to the neck. So it's like, um, yeah, I'll try it on so that I can explain it better because I'm not explaining it very well. So let's put this on really quickly. Okay, so before I show you guys, look at my hair before I show you guys what this looks like when I was pregnant uh sorry what it looks like on now I'm going to show you some quick photos of what it looked like when I was pregnant I definitely didn't have my hair like this when I was pregnant <laughs> but yeah I'm going to insert the photos now and here is what it looks like now so it's like this high neck and it's got like this cut out bit which is ooh Louise <laughs> um and it is, again, I'm not going to do that weird jump thing that I done last time, but it is like proper classy. Oh my God, I actually, I actually love this dress. I think I will probably wear this one um, again soon. Oh, bloody hell. I feel like you could wear this to like a wedding. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Um, yeah, I feel like you could wear this as like a wedding dress, um, wedding guest dress. Anyways, I wore this with like some big hoop earrings. Um, and yeah, I love this dress. It's so thick and luxurious and comfortable and flattering. Wow, I actually look like I've got a bum. Unless I'm just arching my back. Yeah, I'm just arching my back. Not really, like the bum, the bum's kind of there. I think that's like one thing that I'm gonna work on this year. Um, I say it every single year, but I really need a bit of a bum, don't I? Like, um, I kind of haven't really got a bum. So, oh, bloody hell. Sorry, I was just saying before I had a nip slip that um, I think that's that one thing that I'm going to work on this year is getting myself a booty because I've, I'm like flat in that region. I'm not going to lie, like, I mean, I'm not completely flat, but there's definitely space for some booty growth. Um, <laughs> that's definitely something that I want to work on because especially like when you're wearing jeans, it's like, mm, you don't want to be flat, bummed. Um, yeah this is a proper classy dress i really like it um the material is so thick and luxurious you wear this like um, a winter party oh also it's got like these um things I'm not quite sure that that goes with the dress um it's a bit sporty when the dress is a bit classy but i don't know each of their own um i feel like you could wear this like a winter party or like a winter um event because it's really thick and it'll keep you really nice and warm Especially if you put like, I don't wear like spandex, but if you put like spandex underneath this, you're going to be so cosy. Like, you won't even need a coat. It's so, so thick. I can't even explain it. Like, can you see that material? How soft that is. It's like fuzzy. Anyways, so that's the last dress I'm going to try on for you guys. Um, that was just like a really short, um, fun video, basically just comparing what I looked like when I was pregnant in the same dresses that I haven't even tried on yet. So I hope that you enjoyed the video. Um, please do subscribe. I'm always filming loads of different random hauls, um, loads of lifestyle video videos. Um, my hair doesn't always look this bad. I mean, sometimes it does, but not always. So sometimes I do make an effort for you guys. And yeah, I hope to see you in my next video. I love you all. Bye.